Well, in April, if you remember, Mayor Andy Burke announced Chattanooga would take the city's early education agenda to the next level. This by incorporating a new set of citywide sur sur uh, for pre-K children. News Channel 9's Aaron Cooper shows us when 130 early childhood educators were introduced to the city's Seats for Success program for the first time. Like what we give children in the classroom is important because they can't talk, but they can feel. Each of the infant and toddler educators who met here at Chattanooga State on Saturday came for the same reason. Opportunities for, for all the women that are in these rooms. I mean, we're so excited to be here. The opportunity to learn about Chattanooga's new early childhood curriculum, Seats for Success. It'll give us the ability to, to walk down that path the correct way. Saturday was the first time more than 20 state licensed early childhood programs in our city got a glimpse of this curriculum. Classrooms across the city have access to the tools and resources they need to be the best place for kids to be when they're in school. The tools in these kits and the trainings that go along with them provide a uniform structure that will reach across the entire city. Ariel Ford with Chattanooga's Office of Early Learning says our city has never seen structured curriculum for toddlers to this magnitude before. A child in Hickson and a child in East Chattanooga will have the same curriculum. In addition to providing uniformity, the new lesson plan addresses how every child learns differently. We can learn through this curriculum how to use one activity to support lots of kids' different developmental um, stages. The plan is also bilingual. Highlight books in both English and in Spanish. Research shows 90% of a child's brain develops before they start kindergarten. Ford says providing the highest quality education during that time frame encourages positive long-term effects. High school graduation rates increase, um, college attendance increases. And Ford says the program legitimizes early childhood teachers. We are really early educators building that brain architecture and it's just as important as any other educational time frame. Reporting in Chattanooga, I'm Erin Cooper. And trainings for the new curriculum will continue over the next few years. The mayor's goal is to create 1,000 new high-quality early learning seats by the end of his term in spring of 2021.